everyone welcome back if you do not know my name is devin here on my channel i cover all things beauty that includes makeup fragrance and designing here and there if you think that is something you'll be interested in then i hope you stay and subscribe to my channel don't forget to click the notification bell so you're notified every week when i upload and in today's video we have yet another bath and body works haul but this time it is featuring the brand new bridgerton collection this is the diamond of the season. Yes, you guys, I picked up a couple things from this collection. So if you guys wanna hear my thoughts and opinions on this brand new collection, then just keep watching. All right, you guys, so I'm excited about this brand new collection now. As you all know or may not know, um, they are having a bigger Bridgerton collection. I think it's coming out on the 25th, but don't quote me, I'm not 100% sure but it is supposed to be some more candles. Now it is kind of in the air of it's, if it's more body hair coming to that line because I've seen someone say it's supposed to be another body hair. I keep hearing people say it's not. So I am not sure. I did get a couple pieces from the body hair line. I also got a soap and I got the candle. So we are gonna go ahead and talk a little bit about everything. So first of all, we're gonna start off with the candle. I love the packaging for the candle. It is super, super pretty. This candle is retailing for $32.95. So it is a little bit pricey, um, but it does have a beautiful black glass lid. And if you guys don't know, this is kind of some sort of like little velvety type material. Um, yeah, I was really surprised at that. I didn't pay attention to that when I first purchased it, but I'm happy to have it. Now, as you know, the scent notes on here are sparkling peach, spring daffodil, and radiant jasmine. So in the candle, I feel like I'm getting more florals than I am the sparkling peach. I smell the sparkling peach, but I feel like I get a heavy dose of jasmine in this candle. Now, I have not burned this one as of yet. Right now, it's so pretty. Um, I don't know that I will need backups of this unless it smells like amazing, but then we'll have to wait for another sale for this because it's no way I'll be paying 32 anything for any type of candle. But the packaging is really pretty. I do notice that a lot of the jars are not full completely. You know, I feel like Bath and Body Works is kind of skimping on the candles lately because a lot of the candles that I am seeing or I'm getting, I notice that they are not like fully, fully full. And I know they're not always fully full, but that's a nice little gap out of this candle. So yeah, I don't know what's up with that. All right, next thing I picked up was the foaming hand soap. They also, I think, had the gel soap, but I am a foaming hand soap girl. Obviously, same notes. Again, the hand soap actually smells a little bit more floral to me. I get a little bit more jasmine in it and a, like a hint of the peach notes. So it's okay. I don't know that I would need backups of this unless it goes on sale. I also don't know if they're going to be bringing more hand soaps out with the collection. I'm unsure. All right, now to the most exciting part, that is the body care. Y'all, this collection is kind of pricey. So the fragrance mist is $17.95 and then the shower gel is $15.95. I can't remember what the body cream and the lotion was, um, but obviously it will be under this. I use a reward to pick up the shower gel. Um, now, obviously I have not used this stuff yet, but the shower gel smells really, really good. I feel like I get a lot of peach in here and just a hint of floral notes, just a little bit in the background. Um, I haven't used it yet, but I am excited to use this and play with this, but this one actually smells super, super good. Um, if they have some sort of sale, I might go ahead and pick up the body cream or the lotion. But when I smelled them, um, I felt like they were a little bit more floral than my liking. So I didn't pick those up. But what I did, obviously I had to pick up and I did actually pay, matter of fact, now that I'm thinking about it, I paid full price for this. But when I just had the fragrance mist sale the other day, I did go ahead and get a price adjustment. It looks like this. Y'all know it has this like, 
I don't know what this cap is called, but they're putting this on some of the fragrances. I think they put it on the new Dressed in White fragrance. It's also on Luminous. So I don't know, it's like special packaging they're putting this on, but I feel like this top actually really, really fits for this collection because this is a diamond of the season. So y'all, I love this fragrance. I know I feel like a lot of people are saying they're not really into it, I love it. I am a huge peach lover. I feel like the peach is so beautiful, girly, super sparkling. It is such a pretty, pretty peach. I wore it the other night combined with some other like peachy type scents and it was so pretty. My husband said it, it smelled really, really nice on me. It's, it's so pretty. So um, I feel like this does smell a little bit different than all the other peach fragrances I have in my collection. And honestly, I should have brought some out to compare them, but I feel like I have nothing quite like this in my collection. It's a really, really pretty sparkling peach. Like it's definitely smart sparkling. It's so, so gorgeous. Um, I don't really get a lot of the florals in here, which I am happy about because I am not a big floral girl, but I do enjoy this one. You can really dress this one up. This one actually is going to be perfect for the spring season if you like a peach note. Um, so yeah, I just feel like I really, really think this collection is so beautiful. I think they did an amazing job. And honestly, I cannot wait to see what else is going to come out in this collection. Now, that does not mean that I'm going to get everything. I have seen sneak peeks of some candles. Um, there is one candle that I think I want. It's kind of a like more foodie candle. I'm interested in that. But if it's not anything like the notes really, really speak to me, I probably won't be getting anything else in this collection unless they bring out more body care. But this is actually a body care I would love to get a backup of because it is so pretty. I feel like, I'm sorry, my camera had cut off, but I just feel like it's a really classic, very timeless type of fragrance and I am so happy to have her. So yeah, guys, that is it. That is my little thoughts on this brand new collection. I wanna know what you guys think. I am a little bit late with getting this up because, you know, I have just been having a lot going on. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in another video. Bye.